Hi everyone, welcome to GOAS Labs. In our today video, so um, we are gonna go over how to download, how to merge, and also how to clip a digital elevation model from USGS from a USGS website. So uh, for this video, so we are gonna use uh, QGIS. Um, in this case, in my case, I'm using the version three point sixteen. If you don't have um, QAS, don't worry. So you can um, download, download the software um, in its uh, website. So as you can see, the lastest version is 3.22. But I recommend you to download the most stable version, which is the 3.16, which is this one over here. Um, so now let's start. Um, so in order to download the digital elevation model, so I'm gonna use the website uh, called TNM Download V2. In this website, so there are like a lot of data that you can download uh, from United States. Um, and this, this data comes from USGS. So in our case, so we're gonna download the digital elevation model. And um, if we, uh, click here in elevation products so you can see there are like a lot of uh, several re resolution of the digital elevation model um, one meter resolution one third arc second represent 10 meter resolution if you don't know uh, if you want to know um, the the, um, the conversion so you can type this in, in Google arc Or, sorry, and you can use this website. In this web website, you can see all the conversion. So one third arc uh, arc second uh, represent a ten meter ten meters uh, resolution. So in our case, so we are gonna download the ten meter resolution the television model. For a specific area, United States, in this case Puerto Rico, the whole island. So, what you can do is you can use key, click here and show in order to um to to see all the data that is available for uh, United States. So you can see Alaska, whole United States, and also Puerto Rico. So in our case, so we are gonna download the D television model for the whole island. So we are we need to create like a polygon by using this button over here. So let me create like a rectangle over here. In order to stop, we need to click twice um, and right click. This is the rectangle. So now let's click here in search products. And as you can see, um, there are several D television models. So um, if you wanna see those, uh, each of them, so you can use this uh, bottom thumb uh, nail. And you can see all of the D television models. So in our case, so in order to get the whole digital television model for Puerto Rico, so we need to download all these seats raster files. So uh, let me download them. Uh, second one, this one, this one, and this one. It will take some time to download um, all of the raster files. Um, okay, so what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna go to my download folder, and as you can see, five uh, of them have been downloaded. So let's wait for the last one. Perfect. 
um, so we now we have all seeds raster files. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna copy and paste them in the desktop. So let's create a, a folder called the television model. I'm gonna paste them over here. And then I'm gonna select all of them and I'm gonna drag to QJS. And as you can see, um, you will see all of those seeds different rasters. And one thing in common is that when you merge all of them, so you will see uh, the Puerto Rico island. So in this case, the next step that we're gonna do is uh, is gonna be uh, joining or merging um, all of those raster. In order to do that, so we need to go to raster, go to, go to miscellaneous, uh, merge, and over here, click in these three dots, select all. Basically, we are selecting all of the rasters. And let's click uh, OK. And over here, let's um, save the output as a DET elevation model, DEM. And click save and run. So this process, it will take um, some time because it's taking each raster in each uh, and basically it's uh, combining all of them into just one uh, big file so let's wait for it okay perfect so is done so I'm gonna close this window and the next step is uh, I'm gonna basically delete all of them there's it's different raster files that uh, files that we downloaded before and um, if I show this this is the the raster that was generated um, as you can see uh, all of the all of the seats different raster was uh, were, were basically joined in one bit file. So right now, um, as you can see, there are like a, uh, you can notice a I island over here, obviously this one, this one over here, and this one over here, a little one over here. So what I'm gonna do is, um, let's clip this um, the elevation the model. So in order to clip this, you will need to have a shape file um, and the condition that you need to the condition of this is that the the, the shape file uh, needs to overlay the raster so as you can see this is the shape that we are going to use and as you can see um, let me show you something before clip um, clipping the raster we need to make sure about the um, the projections so the projection um, have to be the same so the projection of the raster is 4269 um, 4269 and the projection of the uh, shape file is 4326 so what we need to do is we need to reproject the either the raster or um, or the should be Puerto. Um, either the raster or the shape file. In this case, let's um, reproject the shape file um, by going to Better um, Data Management Tools and reproject layer. Over here, we select the shape file, and over here, this will be the target. Uh, and our case is uh, 4269 is the, um, the projection of the television model and let's save the new file in the shape I folder where to yeah we go um, so we forget that save and let's run this and as you can see 
So um, if, if I go to properties, you can see that the uh, the um, projection is now 4269, which is the same as the digital elevation model. So let me remove the old one. And now the final step that um, we're gonna do is clip, uh, clip the raster. Um, so we basically need to go to extraction and let's select um, clip raster by mask layer. And this option right here, it basically um, clip just the shape that you want to. Um, so input layer will be the detail version model. The mask layer should be the shape file. And as you can see, the uh, coordinate system is the same. And, and now let's save this. So desktop, detail elevation model. So it should be detail elevation model, Puerto Rico. Click uh, save and run. This process will take um, some time, um, but not too much. And let me hide these two layers and this is the final result. So as you can see, so what basically this process did was, uh, let me change the order and let me click here in the information. So for all the pixels that are upside the shape file, so this oh, upside this polygon over here, the, um, let me select this one. So you can see that all of the values uh, will be zero. However, all the pixels that are inside the polygon, so it has a number. 